the original M900 came as Ducati's answer to the cruiser segment and was initially designed to steal sales from Harley-Davidson's Sportster. It was supposed to be easy to ride and more affordable to buy than other Ducatis, something for the everyday man. Those first monsters became some of the most copied motorcycles of all time, most notably by Suzuki's SV650 which achieved a great deal of success itself. But Ducati didn't stop setting trends was there. It was also the first to put a liquid-cooled, four-valve per cylinder superbike engine into a bike in this category when it released the 2001 Ducati Monster S4. Since then, however, Ducati's Monster has abandoned a lot of what made it the standard in the first place. It grew bigger, the styling got a little weird, the dry clutch and air cooling were ditched, and many of the classic lines were abandoned. For 2017, Ducati is finally taking a pause to remember what made those first monsters so great, and the newest revision to the line reflects that. No, Ducati isn't going back to the dry clutch or tossing out the radiator. It's a performance brand and to forgo that progressive sporting heritage would be no different than to ditch Ducati Red. So the 2017 model is a modern high-performance naked bike but does return more to the style of old while getting some updates that really matter. The most notable is appearing. The fuel tank and tail section has been...